Murdoch! And we continue on with more of Dragon Ball Z Sagas, the Pendulum Room. So now we're fighting Frieza in his final form as Bardock. I'll send you to the next dimension. Just a little demo of Bardock's power. There's no reason for use melee combat to increase your Super Saiyan potential. Or he now charge your key to the max. There's no real reason for that because. Bardock can't become a Super Saiyan. Would've been nice though. You just would look like Goku. With some scars. Would've been cool. And the fight takes just as long as if you were Goku in base form. signature attack man that's pretty much all I wanted to demo so Broly. now Broly the legendary Super Saiyan in one of the only well one of two fights where you can fight Goku in Ginyu as Goku or as, um, well as the appropriate episode title, Goku isn't Goku. Let's see what this body can really do. So, Broly is a permanent Super Saiyan character. Now feel the power of the Genyu Force. Now feel the power of the legendary Super Saiyan and his Omega Blaster. Crap, we moved out of the way. Yeah. Ginyu is, a, is just as much of a bastard as Goku is in the hyperbolic time chamber. But as you can see, I'm already doing way more damage to him than normal. Even for Pendulum Room. How the heck did I hit the ground? And then I... Okay, that was a glitch. That wasn't supposed to happen. Oh well. But considering how quickly I can destroy him, yeah, this will be the only level that I'll actually complete. Now, I don't like how they say that you defeated two enemies. You didn't even fight Jace. That's something that I didn't point out in the actual episode. I'm about to wipe him out right now, off screen. One more. Ah, oh well. Let's see if I can pummel the crap out. Cut that out. You idiot. Do you realize how powerful this guy is? Look how how little damage. Whoa. Okay, that's weird. Seventy-five percent. Twenty-five percent. Yeah. I uh, I rarely ever use more key attacks uh, in a fight. Well, in a level, especially if you're trying to become Super Saiyan, you need to build up and then go. But whatever. <coughs> Excuse me. Okay, so next fight. Gohan with one arm. Well, that kind of has some unfortunate implications. Considering that Gohan lost an arm and then when he actually took them on, they killed him. Oops. 
If only this took place in a city, then it would actually be that team. Pretty much. Man, this has to be one of my favorite forms of Gohan. Well, not with one arm, but I mean, just he here. He actually kind of became, uh, he became worthy of his Saiyan heritage, pretty much. I mean, but it was, you know, through unfortunate circumstance that this had to happen. That he became so hardened. Wow. Whatever, man. I could actually still beat him with Gohan. There's not really a difference except for the fact that the fight is just more drawn out because, you know, he's rough. Anyway, time to show off the other Z fighters. Krillin. Yes, we're going with Krillin. And I'm playing the Saiyan Saga because, well, that's kind of relevant. Okay, oops. Wow, I almost already killed him. I actually like this move. The Kienzan, aka the Destructo Disc. Pretty cool. It actually does uh, pretty hefty damage to these little guys, man. Except for the fact that fighting as Krillin is just as difficult as fighting with any other character that doesn't have Super Saiyan. Okay. Uh, I don't know why I even said that. There's pretty much no real difference uh, between the characters other than uh, you know the ability to transform into a stronger form or not gotcha. so now here we go Yamcha in the same area which is probably a mistake considering Yamcha's previous experience with the Cybermen yeah I think that this is probably a bad idea but we'll see. We will see. And Yamcha has the Kamehameha rather than the spirit ball, which actually would have been cool. There are still enemies in this area. Oh well. But yeah, just more, you know, more of the same, pretty much. Yay. I'm actually wondering if I should actually leave commentary in or just uh, like speed everything up. I think I'll leave it the way that it is. Well, I mean, I'm going to cut a lot of this up. So, yeah.
And of course, Yamcha is having difficulty with these guys. Of course. I think on that note, we ought to cut. Look at, look at that. And then he's blocking. Come on. Okay. Yeah, so, yeah, no more of that. <laughs> So, I think it's time to show off one last thing. Level Imperfect Cell, and there's still one other fighter. Tian. Tension Han. Yay. Would have been nice if you could have actually done this, but yeah, I'm just going to do this just to mess around. Hmm. If I really thought about it, I probably could have cut it up so it looked like this is what really happened, but oh well. Yeah, Broly is like your best bet for Pendulum Room to like just breeze through some levels. I mean, it's still difficult. But, that pretty much sums up everything at this point, I mean, yeah. Too bad that you couldn't actually be Super Saiyan for a level. Well, start off a level as the Super Saiyan, but you can't. So, it's been fun. Once I got the upgrades that I wanted, it was a long, difficult road, but we made it. So, I want to thank you guys for watching Dragon Ball Z Sagas, and... With me missing, I will see you all next Let's Play.